On this episode of Small Biz 518, we are here in Troy at Sunhee's Farm and Kitchen, the top Korean restaurant and the best kimchi in the capital region. We started the restaurant about two and a half years ago. Um, really, it came out of this vision of being able to create a safe workplace for refugees and immigrants. Um, and I even brought my family into the mix. They're very much involved. Uh, my mom is the main chef. My dad is the farmer. And so we have the food. We also have the farm in Cambridge, New York. And so we thought that a restaurant would be the perfect place to start. We have English classes Monday through Thursday. We make sure that it's quality classes, people with experience. Um, and then um, a lot of times we invite the staff to partake in those English classes as a part of that professional development of you work with us, but you're also learning with us and growing and hopefully um, being able to um, move on in the career ladder. I know it's not everyone's dream to be a dishwasher. So what we're here for is to be able to empower people to advance despite their current circumstances. There's maybe three Korean restaurants in the entire capital district. Mm -hmm. And so we have a lot of customers but coming in. But yours is in. the best. <laughs> and you said it, not me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so the menu, it really, it fits onto a single page, like rice bowls, we have stews, and everything is a la carte, and we try to explain it in a way that anyone can understand. And it's really interesting when you look into the stories behind these dishes, because it, they actually came about at a time when, in Korean history, you know, Korea was very poor and underdeveloped. It's very s simple, and it brings out the flavor of each, um, of each item and you mix it in with purple rice, you have a kimchi on the side uh, and we also have a house made uh, gochujang sauce with it, which is a hot red pepper paste sauce. A couple seasons ago we had the opportunity to open up the farm which is the farm that my family still lives on but we decided to invite our customers into the farm as a part of a ticketed event. There's a combination of Korean barbecue and a kimchi workshop where my mom will be teaching the workshop with her recipe uh, and and they'll take home a fresh jar of kimchi. And what's even great about the summer season is that the, the participants can go into the garden and pick out the vegetables that they're gonna be using for the kimchi workshop. That wraps it up for this episode of Small Biz 518. For the best kimchi in town, stop by Sunhee's Farm and Kitchen.